Hey guys, Cool Blind Way back. I'm Rick. Aaron. Aaron. We're here with Rome, where it feels like we're about ready to uh, move into the next stage yeah. of Roman history. I feel like season one, he has the city. He has the what? That's all. He has, he has, he has uh, everything, I guess. Mm -hmm. He at least has, he has the city, he has whatever it was at Pompeii. Had, I suppose, like, <laughs> there's no one else now. Yeah, the Senate. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know what, uh, Titus and Vern, Varinus, Varinus, Varinus? I don't know how you say it. I, I've said it twice differently, and I don't know which one's right. I believe... Lucius. Yeah, just, just go Lucius. <laughs> <laughs> Done! <laughs> That's what I did. <laughs> wow, I feel so left out. He at least is excited to Caesar. Yeah, you're not very happy to see him in the long run. Shrug. Those headlights are weird. Headlights. You don't see the headlights? The candles? The headlights. Write it down. The following noblemen returning from Greece have received pardon of mm. Zeta. Marcus Gullius Cicero. Cicero. Gaius Cassius Longinus. Longinus. Julius Brutus. Brutus. The traitor Pompey has fled to Egypt. Glorious Caesar follows. They don't know he's dead yet. Yeah, uh, news takes some time. Look at this place. That's Alexandria. A, it's a, a lighthouse. Camel. They just have his head sitting somewhere. Turn it into a bowl. This isn't like the monkeys in Indiana Jones, Rich. That's exactly what I was thinking of. It has got low steam. Emo death. Why is everyone painting unibrows on him? That's a child. A bored one. <laughs> son of Ra? Yeah. His dad was a bird? The son mm, is a pharaoh. Oh, you damn kids! <laughs> I shit on her. <laughs> is it shit? Or is it cat? <laughs> Man, it's an Egyptian word. No fears at all about Cleopatra. <laughs> Cleopatra. Do we think you will... <laughs> <laughs> You are enemies. He was a consul of Rome. A consul of Rome. And they were friends. Where's his family? See, in public, that's kind of what I expect from him. <laughs> that's a tear. Yeah. And he had his poster hanging in his room when he was a kid, you know? Kind of. What? Right? Like he was like his hero. Yeah. Oh. Like he had posters. I would just use a metaphor. You know what I mean. You will take half the men returned to Rome immediately. Doesn't he have to, like, hook up with Cleopatra? Some would call it hubris. It's only hubris if I fail. <laughs> <laughs> when you find her, you will oh. treat her with the utmost respect. Who are you sending? You Who would you send? Obey her. Suppose someone the gods favor? Understood, sir. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you have something to say. Can I take Pulo? It was my actions that brought him here to this end. If I had done my duty, indeed. I... Dismiss. It's almost like the like this part is just kind of yeah. Yeah, I don't care anymore. In the name of the Republic, I have come to collect seventeen thousand thousand drachma. Seventeen thousand thousand. All money is borrowed from Pompey and other agents of the Republic now unable It's to all of the dead. <laughs> there. There's for your payment. His Majesty forgets he's a vassal to Rome. Vassal? I am king! I Sit am- Sit down! Oh shit, he's scary. <laughs> <laughs> Cleopatra's foolishness has stirred unrest in some parts. Nothing serious. Sound serious. Well, I do not wish to appear unreasonable. Let's solve this war real quick. I will accept 10,000 oh. thousand drachma. He did take that. It's as hot as Vulcan's dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Star Trek thing. <laughs> Egypt was a great nation long before Rome. Was it? Mumped it up now then, haven't they? <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't care what he says. I know we're wasting. Wow. That's kind of cool. They have posters. I don't know what I see them. They said they have her, right? Yeah. My men could be with her by nightfall. So are they waiting to find the Cleopatra people, or are they waiting for these people to lead them to Cleopatra? Mm. 
What how easy it is to follow people in the desert on horse without them knowing. How much water you have? How often are you looking behind you, I guess? The re rear mirrors. Sure. But I feel like it's like, it's gonna be weird if you see anybody behind you if you do look behind you, right? Versus like, if I'm driving down the street and I see a car. It depends. I mean, they have roads, trade roads. But yeah, they probably keep her off the beaten path. Mm -hmm. Is she chained up? Slap me. Oh, she's smoking in that pipe. And they've just been holding her mm -hmm. so they could kill her at some point if they wanted to? That would have happened. Normal. Oh hell yeah! You gonna run? You gonna fight? Nope. Oh, hero step. Got a job to do. Ah! 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 That's some, that's some killing. I think you got him. Hi. <laughs> Hello, ladies. <laughs> Your name would live forever. What is his name? Do you think I could borrow Septimius? Borrow. Most grateful. Here's the murderer. Is this gonna lead towards it? It's, this is part of his plan. Yeah. Hey, he killed Septimus. Let's kill him. Him who bears his message is him that killed Pompey. Well, <laughs> can you read? <laughs> it was sealed. What are we doing now? Putting up some decorations. Oh. <laughs> My good strong chin. Titus? Looks like a mean old man to me. Titus. Who's she talking about? Caesar she on the coin. The Caesar on the coin. Oh, I just she talking about? Yeah, I think so. It was like, there's no way she's talking about, you know, George Washington on the quarter. <laughs> you know, like, look at his chin, you know, like. You got what you got, right? You got what you got. All right. Yes. When we got the J.C. Penny catalog when we were kids, just saying, you had what you had. Oh, she's a snake. What is she smoking? Opium, I think. Copium? Copium, yeah. Look at that bed. Huh? Look at that. Her bed. Look at oh, the what cage. Day? Whatever's in there is going crazy. Getting high on the fumes. She knows how to beat her slaves well enough, but she cannot throw away that pipe. And she knows Is that it. Mrs. Fig? Is that from Andor? The lady from Andor, Aaron? Maybe. I think it is. Throw it out. Just gonna go quit cold turkey? You could die. You're in there smoking and these guys have to carry your ass. Jesus. <laughs> Man. Getting contact high, you know? There's so many people carrying that. Guy in the back side. How many people are in there? Look at that. Well, there's like three people in there, but look at this it thing. It does not need to be that ornate. It's made of like stone and gold and stuff. She's Make a, some wheels. She's a queen. She's possibly a divine. Drug addict. I'm real lazy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just as lazy as they are divine. <laughs> she wants me badly. See, maybe she was on him. Touch her, you die. I'm not stupid. Just said she wants me. <laughs> I want like shoulder harnesses. Yeah. I think. Like those things you can use to carry stuff. Like you put between two people. Yeah. And you lift. Maybe that. Or at least it's having a march like a marching or, band or something. You know what? Oxen. Yeah. Just wheels. <laughs> wheels would be alright. Pushing it would be better than holding it up and walking with it, you know? Wheels would be much more bumpy ride though, right? And sand is the tricky part, right? Yeah. Have them still hold it, but they don't have to walk. They're on wheels. And they can think it's suspension. <laughs> you know? No. Why? Gotta get some color in her lips. Uh, Holding up the coin. Uh -huh. <laughs> hmm. yeah, close enough. Leather. Olives. Not so bad. It's a hell of a plan. Coitus means to make babies. Exactly. So. Make babies. Titus! <laughs> 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 he must do as he is told. Naomi. 
Let me give you a hand. Get up. This insect refuses me. <laughs> yeah, face. Princess Cleopatra and Hey. Grace, I can solve life. this problem. <laughs> What's the problem? Oh, okay. He's gonna hesitate for no seconds. We got him with his belt. What up? Reporting for duty, Mom. He doesn't know what for. What's he smell like? Blood, probably. Oh my god, cut to! He <laughs> cannot sleep. What's the noise? It's them ululating. They need the fertility gods Is it to, them outside? to help them get pregnant. Luckily, if my deaf ear, I just got turned. Can't hear anything. I don't think I could pick up. It's baby. like people cheering you on. I don't think I could finish. Like a, I, I, swear I, I can't. I don't, but you, just, you and people just like ask you in a Oh, no, 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 no. They're encouraging you. Yeah. I don't want them booing, you know? <laughs> when they start cheering, I can smash. Yeah. I do better. You're doing a terrible job. I mean, I'll, uh, you know, I don't want that. <laughs> So her plan is get pregnant, meet Caesar, have sex with him, and then and the baby. Yeah. It's yeah. his baby. Yeah. I don't want to know. <laughs> you value your life, you won't speak of it again. <laughs> it's only obeying orders. Bloody good orders, too. What do you think Caesar will do if he hears of it? That sh his baby is yours? Not stupid. I shall not speak of it. You can't a secret to save your life. You've got a mouth like a drill. <laughs> no one will believe you anyway, right? And you think, I don't know. <laughs> Man, Titus is just so lucky all the time. <laughs> he is blessed by the gods. And hey, good old Lucius. I'm a queen, you must do what I say. <laughs> Lucius is like, no, I cannot. Do you think it was for his wife? I think that's why he doubted I it. I think so. I'd like to think that's why he did it. Yeah. You know, I think, I think like he was tempted and he stopped. <laughs> you have the... Beautiful sun god, queen, daughter, lady. You're like, I, sh I should. She commanded it. The hell of her time. <laughs> yep. I thought it was a dead body. Daughter. Mistress of Sedge and Beast. Oh, they did a good job. They should have accomplished. <laughs> See, so you already got in trouble for one mistress. I'm sure, this one will be fine. <laughs> oh, well done, Majesty. Oh, thank you. What's the game? In the tail and the slave. Oh. <clears throat> now you play that game when you were Black Water Rick instead of you having to like catch us. <laughs> we were just kidding you. <laughs> <laughs> so they're siblings? Mm hmm. Yeah. Just belly to belly suplexes them off the throne. Oh. 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 Mistress. It must not speak. It must die. Who's gonna follow that command? I think you should kill the guy in red. I think he was leading more shit. Him. It's him. See? Uh, he's gonna walk into his sword backwards. We have more heads for the wall. <laughs> they have more <laughs> They're spikes. going to more! Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Is that what these spikes are meant for? Yes. I mean, that's what they look like. There's like a blood trail. For, for like a Christmas wreath, but nope. A Christmas wreath? Yeah, you never know, man. Those go on the door. Uh, they killed them both, didn't they? She's gonna face them the right way. Man, that's your newspaper. You know, wake up in the morning. What's the wall look like? Yeah. Well, <laughs> I had a bit of a coup last night. It's a headline. <laughs> That's good Thank shit. You. Is that only because there's three of them, like in a row? Like, if it's just one, is it still a headline? I don't think so, no. You need, like, all three of them, right? Yeah, you gotta have at least three points in a line, right? Yeah. Two points. Maybe two. Two points. Why save me so heroically from death, if not to use me? He has the wheel of Titus or Lucius. I think he has to, or else the baby won't make sense. <laughs> Why are we back here? It's like you're watching the room again. I don't know. Like we've been here. Like people? we haven't been here the whole episode. Why are we here? Do remember other people like sex too? Like, well, right. other people that love Caesar. I didn't forget. And, uh, and each other. Love is the love is growing more distant. Seed has been planted. Uh, I think what's the. That's what they're saying right there. With that, right? I don't know if that could be a battle coming thing or. Like something's coming? Yep, I think so. I will place this shaft firmly in the sands of Egypt. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh. They actually.
actions really started when the, the slow mo thing right. <laughs> slows down. <laughs> How do they know what they're doing in there? Oh! Yeah, they're shit. here for a different reason. Oh, okay, I thought they were all like, yeah, banger! <laughs> <laughs> oh, geez. What are they here for? We have like 20 guys. If we were to communicate with them, we might. We might. This is Cicero. How <laughs> strange. <laughs> Give me your hands, Brother Cicero. Hmm. Oh my heart. Nothing escapes me. I will cut off these soft pink hands and nail them to the Senate door. Sounds merciful. He's not doing it yet. Therein lies the mercy. Yeah, just interrupted him being treacherous. <laughs> <laughs> Caesar has lifted the siege and massacred the armies of Ptolemy. What? How'd they manage that? Because he got Cleopatra's supporters on his side now. And enough time for his own legions to come. Mm -hmm. So was there a fight? There was. I wonder if we'll hear about it. More that. than one. Hopefully we'll hear. Oh. There's the aftermath of one. A baby. A baby. A little Titus baby. <laughs> you don't know. It's I know. I can see it from here. <laughs> the confidence. The potential to live life. I can see it. I like how they modeled a lot of the extra head dress things mm. from Padme. What? Sure. <laughs> I get what you mean. <laughs> yeah. My baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Never speak of this again. Guys, Rick had to leave. He wasn't feeling well. So uh, he's going to be out of this discussion. Mm -hmm. But what was the reaction? Me and you are going to speak. We're going to talk. Yes. The new headline, No More Rick. The new headline? Yep, and we just put a head on top of one of those spikes. Is it Rick's head? Yeah, it's Rick's head. So we'll just put Rick's head back. No, we won't do that. That's dark. <laughs> that is dark. He'll be fine. Um, we just watched another awesome episode of Rome. Sure. With a baby. With the baby. And baby making. Right? Titus is a, a kingmaker. They, I was wondering, because like, at one part, they were like, Caesar spent the better part of a year in Egypt. I'm like, better part of a year? Okay, so that's over six months. Yeah. <laughs> What's that mean, man? They got that baby. They got a baby, and it's pretty big. <laughs> I love Lucius. <laughs> Everybody Damn. else Titus. is doing all this Even stuff. Titus is like playing, yay, and Titus yay. is sitting there like, quit looking at me, man. What are you doing? And he was cheering. He yeah, thought okay. he shouldn't cheer, I guess. So I understand. So it wasn't going to work out. Like, Cleopatra needs to be able to have, to show fruit of this union very quickly, right? To get power. So we'll get this process started go find me a roman yeah i guess and then bed the roman the first roman's like no i got another lady that this insect i'm trying I mean, to bed i i respect lucius I'm just not doing that yeah he, he's how could he look he's his like wife a man of in honor the and, tr yeah. and truth you yeah. know he's trying not to he told she he told wife, caesar why he didn't kill pompey yeah. or capture pompey he's I mean, he didn't tell her why he wasn't doing he it. He didn't. But that's, that's my assumption. Yeah. And he, I mean, he seemed upset about it. Yep. Because, I mean, like, how often do you get to sleep with a queen, I guess? I know. As a as a hey, soldier, man, he, you yeah. know? Like Rick like, said in the reaction, he felt the temptation. Sure. The hierarchy there, you yeah. know? It's like... The hierarchy of power. Yeah. It's about to change. Yeah, you know, like slaves, and people, uh -huh. soldiers, senate, queens, And look, man, he's got a good woman at home that was true to him. And he knows that for a fact. Right? So he's going to be true to her. We can't tell. Well, no, he knows that sure. she's been true. What do you mean? She hasn't been true? Man. Right? If Titus would have known what was going on, do you, think, do you think Titus would have told him? Like, if he was, like, going there, she wants the Roman to sleep with her, I can't, I can't do it. i got a wife who's been loyal to me and <laughs> thought I was dead and, you know, and, like, all that kind of stuff. He's like, oh, she hasn't. <laughs> yeah, I just wonder if Just Titus, bang the heart, baby. <laughs> I wonder if Titus would have changed and be like, all right, going in, you know? He's such a bro. Uh, Titus backs your play. Yeah, I know. And I love I, I just I love how optimistic he is. But yeah, the play that Titus made was to become the father of a future ruler. That's some luck. Or willingness to help. Is it gonna be <laughs> people any help? What's gonna happen back home with Caesar when he comes back and 
there was a baby between him and Cleopatra. Like, I don't think everyone there was cheering and being like, yeah, who's the babe? Whose daddy is that? You know? Like, it's his son. What is a legacy if not sons? Not having yeah, I know, sons, right? Like, he has a wife and he has, back in Rome and everything. And, like, mm-hmm. what's going to happen well, there? That's you. That's you. Was, you got three so, sons already, Aaron. It was, Your legacy is good. Caesar's isn't. There's was so much issue with, uh, with, what's her name? The girl who's sleeping with Octavia. Yeah. Good old. Whatever's going on there. Servilia. Servilia, yeah. I knew it was an Who was like, given the gift name. of D. That's how I remember her name. What? You didn't remember her name. You had to look it up. What do you think of the headlights? <laughs> you don't know? Uh, I said about those, it looks like headlights. I don't know if you saw them. I, I mean, I saw them. I didn't immediately see them as headlights, but maybe if I see them again and imagine myself like a deer, uh, maybe I, 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 I'm going to be open. You know what? Let me know when they're up. As soon as I open my eyes, I will judge if I think they look like headlights. By the way, everybody, there's also live music out right now. Uh, so if you hear like some drumming or people singing, it's not you, it's us. All right, see, look at the headlights. That's a face. They're heads and they're lights. I get it. <laughs> I'm like, why? Dude, I was, why? I put so much work into opening my eyes and trying to imagine headlights. I know. It and was it was crazy. all for a pun. No, I'm just like, why do they? Why? What's the? If Rick was here, I wanted to know. Like, when you said this... it in the reaction, I was like, huh? And I saw like the last part of it. I was like, oh fuck, these must look like headlights. <laughs> no, they are. <laughs> but I'm assuming they're candles with like, I don't know, casts of heads or well, yeah, masks you just, of some no, you sort. Just, or... It's like a face uh, thing, right? Like a death mask. But like, is this like, yeah, is that like ancestors that have passed and like they remember I know that was a thing in some called the death mask is a thing I think in Roman culture where like upon your death they do plaster or something of your face or just dip it in some is that what that's meant to be or is Uh, that is that a different I was just curious as to why they had these headlights fuck man I don't know what it's meant to be it might be meant to keep the kids out of the kitchen in the middle of the night you know Uh, little fat boys like me trying to sneak to the kitchen and I'm like oh god the headlights are on (laughs) you know I don't want to go past them (laughs) you don't know I don't judge (laughs) <laughs> the, your mom had those blocking your kitchen. Yeah, like, just uh, turns on the faces of like the people judging Zod on <laughs> Superman the movie. Like, ah! Well, especially too if like if they're off and if they are yeah. like ancestors, like uh-huh. grandparents and stuff like that. Could you imagine like I'm scared. sneaking through and all of a sudden like your your dead grandfather's face just lights what up? What are you doing, boy? Need another oatmeal cookie? <laughs> <laughs> How'd you know it was oatmeal? What for? <laughs> I thought it was interesting too that Caesar was seemed very displeased that Pompey was killed. I don't know if it was the fact that he was just killed, Very upset. or that he felt that it was like a in a barbarish, barbarish nature. He was a. I mean, no, I get you. Like the thing about Caesar is he's ex, he's so performative in public, but he does it in a way where I believe it. Like mm. I, I no, he really is upset here, but he kind of surprised me last episode, so he might not be as. It does mean something that he was like he was me. How many years ago? He was the hero of Rome. I mean, that's how I see myself. Sure, yeah. But, like... The great fighter. And- one day, I will be in a situation where things aren't great, and I should be treated with more respect. There will be someone who will take over Caesar's spot, right? So, like, he doesn't want to be where Pompey is. Yeah. I also like Lucius, like... He was, like, apologizing, being like, yeah, if I had done my duty, he wouldn't be dead. And mm-hmm. he, was, he was just like, yep, and go away. I mean, they I performed saying. their mission to perfection he they brought her not necessarily unmolested but they brought her sure like the, they snuck her so, in yeah. and her uh which her like lady that's with her i don't know what those ladies are called the ladies are like i'm here to they're make slaves, sure yeah right? her they're, slave ladies. i don't know what they the her chief of slave staff or whatever it is i'm not sure slave of staff yeah uh I'm, I think that's Mrs. Fig from Harry Potter. Thus, she is uh, the mother from Andor. Serial mom. Mm, ma- Not Marva is Marva. Uh, Marva is Andor. Wait, so which person from Star Wars do you think it is? Uh, the Imperial dude's mom that has cereal. Oh, the, okay. The one I like. Why, I don't know why I can't suck. remember her name right now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just doesn't like him. Um, I don't know what her name is either. What's his name? Okay, that makes more sense because I'm like. Maybe, but then after I said maybe, I was like, "Wait a minute, who the fuck's Mister F- Mrs. Fig in Ms. Star Fig. Wars?" <laughs> I'm like, "What? What Mrs. Fig?" Maybe I don't understand who he's talking about. That could be her. I don't know if we can find the shot or not, but I think it's her. 
Uh, Cyril was the name of the... I keep saying Cyril, but Cyril is the name of the dude, the Imperial. Edie Karn was her. Like, I think it's the same person. Look at that. Look at the nose. We could just... Noses don't change, Aaron. I don't know. I don't know what method you look at. Look up stuff. But we'll find out. <laughs> You're just looking at, like, pictures of her nose? <laughs> Catherine Hunter is that Catherine Hunter? name. Yeah, Catherine Hunter. Catherine Hunter? All right. Ha <laughs> um, ha! Tragedy Macbeth, Mrs. Arabella Fig. Is that what her name is? Fig, yep. Dr. Harry got and, attacked by the Dementors and the and Andor, she was Edie Karn. Edie Karn. Yeah, Cyril Karn, Edie Karn. Cyril Karn. Yeah, that's how I remember his name. Cyril, Cyril. But yeah, nice work. Connection! Yeah. What's a vassal? Vassal. Is that just like a vessel? Uh, vassal is like uh, they're your lord. Your lord? You're a, uh, well, like you're a ruler, but you're under this other ruler. Like you owe to them. Like you're a vassal. It's like Always a lord you know, to a king. Motherfucker, Rick needs to be here for these questions. Yeah. Well, let me just look at That's why up. I wrote down headlights and vassals. Just remember what I said, but the real answer is, and you can tell me if my answer was at all right. A vassal is a holder of land by feudal tenure on conditions of hom- homage and allegiance. Hmm. Okay. So, like, you can hang out and be the ruler here, but really you're the ruler under Rome. Okay. Right? So, like, yeah, you're king. But when I'm here, I'm king. I, I think is what it's kind of meant to be. Hmm. A person or country in a subordinate position to another. So is my first definition work? I think it's pretty close, I guess. Yes. yes. Now I know all of Rome things. Why do we even need Rick? Like someone slanted up against the wall? Yeah. Who's a vassal? A vassal. That yeah. way they're doing a vassal. What's movie. a vassal? <laughs> <laughs> a vassal? I think it sounds like asshole. <laughs> I guess so, yeah. But in a different accent. Uh, yeah, okay. I get it. We do need Rick for this question. They said she was... Oh. I have the note written, hot as Vulcan's dick. What was the that context? Was, that's what Titus said. He said the whole whole of Egypt was hotter than Vulcan's dick. Okay. Which, okay. Is, which is like a Star Trek thing, right? Vulcan is definitely a Star Trek thing. Aaron and I are not they, the they two do, Trekkies on the... I think they the, do this this stuff. I mean, it's this. I mean, it's this. It's something like this. Maybe. I'm not really sure. Vulcans. I know Naruto shit. Vulcans. No, because I can make shadow clones. I'm assuming it's a god of something. The god of fire, including the fire of volcanoes, deserts, metalworking, and the forge in ancient Roman religion. So he was saying it's hotter than their Roman fire gods. It's, yeah, but hotter was, than the fire god's dick. But I also like that Lucius, Lucius was like, but it's, it's unwise. These are old gods here. Yeah. You don't want to displease the gods. Yeah. And he never cares about any of that. No. He, he won't mock But he god. respects Egypt's... Longevity that it's been a, a civilization for so long, even before Rome. He's obviously part of Rome, and he's gonna why? Because it has been pretty, you know, lasting, right? So you got to throw respect Egypt's way. Mm. I like that. That's good. I, I just love how Titus has no care for it. No, he didn't care about any of the yeah. gods or anything. I, I, I really love him. Because I um, suck my dick. <laughs> I, I think the longer yeah, the longer the episode has gone, or the episodes have gone, I've. Loved them together more. Sure. You know? It's like a buddy cop movie. It, it really right? does feel like those two together can become mm-hmm. one whole competent character. Well, when he was sending Lucius yeah. to go get Cleopatra, I'm like, oh, dang, is he not, he's not sending Titus too? Yeah. He's just leaving him here? I know. I, I was mean, like, what the hell? And I guess he just like, you're coming with me. You're coming with me. Why? Because you complete me. Like, those two complete each other. They make up for each other's weaknesses. He's like, hey, grab the other guy who's yeah. God's favor. You both go. That's the ship of, this, of the show for me. Like, those are the two guys he needs to send on whatever mission because the gods will just let them do it. Exactly. Right? Yep. And I'm looking forward to seeing, like, like I feel like we have to be getting back to the idea of, like, okay, now we have Rome. And we have Rome. Now, now and it's more tyrants. about, like, it's less about the wars and more about, like, maybe treachery and betrayals yeah. and that kind of stuff, right? Like, sure. Is Egypt going to be mad with anything that's happening? They're, they're kind of mad, but they've kind of yeah. taken over, right? Caesar's won, I guess. Yeah. Now they've taken care of grain back in Rome. Mm-hmm. But Rome also Octavia has... Octavia is uh, banging Caesar's former mistress. Yeah, but he has a new one. Yeah. Like, sorry, honey, I gotta go check on Egypt. I'm kind of with you where I'm like, oh, okay. 
who cares? <laughs> a little bit, but well, I didn't know why. Well, we... I mean, to be fair, it's also HBO, and it's uh, at a time where there wasn't a lot of res- representation on television. So, you know, I don't sure. know. Sure, it was just one of those things where it's like we haven't seen them like almost like the entire episode. Yeah, like I think in the very beginning there was her and her son. Yeah, and he was just, it was just like, hey guys, you know, sex. And we're like, yeah, it's like other characters are also doing it right now. I'm like, oh shit, really? Yeah, it, it was. It's just... like these two. And I'm like, oh, they're having sex. And he's like, yeah. And I'm like, oh, okay. What now? Well, we'll see. I'm like, oh, all yeah. right. It must be going somewhere, I assume. Take, I... take me on a journey. But right now, I'm on a ride where I'm like, I don't know what's going to happen. Where are we going? <laughs> That's kind of the Titus. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> and I was very satisfied with what happened. So is he. <laughs> you see, he he laid down his sigh, like, as was his legacy. <sighs> Cleopatra, what do you? how do you feel about uh, her introduction to the show? And this is obviously a, a pretty big character. Sure. Uh, I mean, she threw out her pipe. I like how small she is. Like, I, I like how she can command respect and, you know, uh, she has all this confidence about, it. is it a guy? Then I'm good, you know? But she's very, very small, you know? She's not imposing. She's not, like, classically going to dominate others. She has to do it with what she's got, and what she's got is very, very specific skills that she's really good at. Yeah, well, she, no, she didn't have a pipe. I don't say she had a pipe. She had a pipe. She didn't have a pipe now. No. She could get so. a, you want a pipe, she could get a she, pipe. She seems okay. I'm just curious on, like, if we see her more, or is that kind of all we get? Yeah. Um, I was, I mean, because she seemed pretty like, oh, she's always high. How effective is she going to be? But, I mean. And they're like, ah, she can't even get rid of it. She goes, there's a can. Get yeah. rid of this. Yeah. I mean, she has, definitely has willpower. So, I'm interested. It was not the version of Cleopatra that I was kind of ready to, to experience, but I'm, I'm here for it. They're sure, gonna, they're gonna take me in a well, way I didn't I think, think was gonna happen. She led Caesar to do what she wanted, right? Mm-hmm. With the uh, the two advisors that the the king boy yeah. had. King boy. Yeah. I don't know what it, I don't know what exactly he is. The the vassal. <laughs> the vassal. Yeah. The vassal. Yeah. So then we put all the heads up, and that's what she wanted. She wanted I like how in Rome it has to be a guy like uh, making sure you have all the context, but on, uh, over here they're just like. No longer leader. <laughs> and you're like, oh, fuck. What's that mean? Yeah. And then they boarded everything up. <laughs> and like, watch out for falling rocks. Oh, yeah. It's fucking hot. I thought today. All right. <laughs> That's Vulcan's dick. Vulcan's dick. That is how Aaron and I wrap up a conversation. And maybe you might be thinking, ah, oh, I liked that. Are there other shows that are just Eric and Aaron? You can check out Superman and Lois that was just airing uh, this season. It was a fantastic show, and not enough people are watching it. So really please good. check out that show and Aaron and I's discussions on it.